What's going on YouTube? It's Elevated Ike coming at you guys with another video. Today we're going to be checking out another episode of Brand Feature. This time we're featuring the brand Entree, one of those brands that's definitely making some fire, especially on their unknown collection. So let's get right into it. Entree is a Brooklyn-based streetwear brand started out in the late 1990s, so you can see a lot of influences from graffiti and street culture, but they're also now working into contemporary and sportswear. So a huge thank you goes out to Reginald and Krista for giving me the clothing to show you guys in this video. Also, shout out to whoever packages these boxes. I was expecting to get a bunch of clothes in plastic bags, but they do put each garment into as many boxes as they can fit into the shipping box. Starting off with the first item, we have the Clothes for Prayer crew neck. Now this is from the main Entree line. So we have a lot of graphic prints, a lot of vivid colors. On the front, we have the praying hands with Clothes for Prayer in this neon type of print. And then on the sleeves, we have their iconic bear, the teddy bear. And then on the other side, we have Roman numeral two with Entree also printed underneath that. A basic crew neck, I like the I like the use of the neon colors. This is my second piece that uses this type of graphic of neon. Next up, we have the Teaser's hoodie. Now this one is in a black and white colorway. Definitely a classic color combination. The hoodie features an overlapping collar. Then you have the teddy bear printed on the front going God mode, Teaser season. This hoodie also features eyelets on the armpit area to help with the airflow. And since it's so fitted, they also included elastic material on the sides to help with your movement while you're wearing it. Now getting into the more mature looks, we have the velour sweatshirt, which is also under the Entree line. But in my opinion, this is the transition between Entree and Unknown, because on this sweatshirt, it features no graphics. It's all about the materials. Entree used premium velour fabric to make the sweater. And even though it's all black, the seam and construction detailing definitely stands out a lot. They also decided to include zip enclosed kangaroo pockets on the velour sweaters which was a nice touch with their own custom zippers my favorite part about the sweatshirt is definitely the material it's not thin it has a little bit of weight to it and the fabric is very soft Switching over to the unknown collection, first up we have the Ripstop tee in red. Now this shirt is made of a crazy combination of fabrics. We have polyester, cotton, rayon, and spandex aka super soft. Also we have those hits of nylon on the front area of the shirt, almost reminiscent of tech wear. Also on the back, the full back is made of the nylon in the Ripstop technique, meaning that if you were to get a little hole in it, it would not spread at all. And now for the final item, we have a pair of black French Terry joggers from the Unknown Collection. The joggers are made from a French Terry material. And then we have custom Entree Unknown aglets. 
We also have stitching running along all both sides of the pants creating these geometric patterns. That's it for the video. Thank you for taking the time out to watch. Once again, a huge thank you goes out to Reginald and Krista for hooking me up with the pieces to show you guys in this video. I would highly recommend checking out Entree, especially the Unknown Collection. Since we're getting older, our style is maturing. I definitely think the Unknown line has some pieces that would suit that more mature look. Or if you just wanted to switch your style up, I'll leave links to all the items that I showed in the video in the description below so you guys can check them out. Also, let me know which one was your most favorite or even which one was your least favorite item. Sound off in the comments below. Thank you for watching once again. It's been Elevated Ike. Until next time, peace.